I'm Chinu Her. Flu season is approaching and local doctors are encouraging parents to get their kids the flu shots. A local doctor says it's important to get the flu shot this year especially because we're also dealing with the COVID-19 pandemic. Kids aren't less likely to catch the coronavirus and doctors say if they have both COVID-19 and the flu, it could be devastating. I'm John Sheeran. A new report says Georgia was wrong to purge nearly 200,000 inactive voters from the polls late last year after being unable to verify the voters' addresses. But the reporter behind the study found that those 200,000 voters do still live at their same addresses. The Secretary of State's office stands by its methods, says the purge was necessary to protect the election from fraud. Regardless, both sides say everyone should now check online to see if they're still registered and then re-register if necessary by October 5th in order to vote in the November elections. I'm Tracy Potts. The presidential candidates in two different directions today, but both in battleground states. President Trump in Pennsylvania after telling supporters in North Carolina to vote twice, once by mail, once in person, to test a system that he has claimed without proof is fraudulent. And then today, we'll see Joe Biden in Kenosha, Wisconsin after the president's visit there. But he's doing one thing the president did not, meeting with the family of Jacob Blake.